welcome back guys, Frosty Gaming here to give you another Unity tutorial. Today I'm going to talk about how to set up an external text editor with Unity. There are these things called scripts in Unity that you're going to write and it's program code that's going to add functionality to your game. In order to write these scripts, you're going to have to use some kind of external tool, a text editor or an IDE, to write the code. Personally, I use Visual Studio 2012. There's a lot that you can use though. So I have my scene here, and this is a script. I just called it player controller. It's not got anything in it right now. This is just the default stuff. But if I double click it, it opens up in Visual Studio. Now in order to do this, you're going to want to go to Edit, Preferences, and it gives you the Unity Preferences. We're going to go to External Tools, and you can see here that my external script editor is Microsoft Visual Studio 2012. And I've also got 2010 on this machine and the mono develop that's built in. This is default. If you downloaded Unity and you haven't messed with this, then mono develop is going to be what shows up. Now, if you don't have the option that you want, you can look for the executable through browse. So let's say I wanted to use Sublime. I could get the path, I could go program files, Sublime Text 2, and then open up the executable for Sublime Text 2. Now, when I open up my script, it opens up in Sublime. Sublime is really nice, but it doesn't have a lot of the features that Visual Studio does. And the executable for Visual Studio is a little harder to find. So if we want to go find it, if it's not in this list, if you have the full version of Visual Studio, you're going to want to go to your local disk, Program Files 86, Microsoft Visual Studio, the latest version, so the highest number, Common 7, IDE, and then it's going to give you get you into this folder and the executable for Visual Studio 2012 is devenv.exe so you just double click that and it'll work now Microsoft Visual Studio costs money if you want to use it and you don't want to spend any money there's an express version Microsoft Visual Studio Express and you can also use that with Unity it's free you just can't add any plugins into it and the path to that should be similar but the executable might not be called devenv.exe alright I think that's about it for this video I hope you uh, got what you wanted and I'll see you next time